but he couldn't hold on. That's going to do it here in this one. Phil, before we go, how about this win? How much will this one count? You know, Jim, all wins are nice. This one was done easy. You didn't have to sweat too much over it. You feel good, and you just enjoy the next couple days. You see this so many times with this quarterback, Jim, to play in today's game. It's just another nice throw by the QB. Uh, he has a beautiful throw in motion. If guys get open, he puts it right on the money. Celebration. It's the Dawn Patrol. And Drew Brees lifting a city out of despair to stand together as a community. These are the Saints. It's about elevation in the ATL. It's the flight of Tony G. The Dirty Bird. And Dion high step into pay dirt to rise up to the challenge. These are the Falcons. We're here in Atlanta for this Week 12 matchup between the New Orleans Saints and the Atlanta Falcons. Hello, friends. Jim Nance along with Bill Sims. Do we have a little upset special coming your way today? One team's unbeaten. Well, I know the undefeated team hopes not, but I'll tell you, Jim, the other team, they're excited about getting out there and getting the chance to put that first blemish on the record. You're always looking for an edge, and when you go against an undefeated team, that's a big edge for your football team. Okay, let's head down to the field now for the start of this one. The Saints getting set to return to kickoff. He'll take a knee here, and that means the offense will start the game at the 20. Here's the man who, in 2011, set the NFL's single-season pass yardage record. Quarterback, Drew Brees. Things have worked out great for Drew Brees down here in New Orleans. You know, it's a good thing the San Diego Chargers didn't want him anymore because he got hooked up with Sean Payton, 
and his career has just gone upwards ever since then. Here's a look at the Saints offense, starting with the offensive line. This is an offense that has one of the most dangerous passing attacks in the NFL this season. They send the tight end in motion. Second and 12. And they sack the quarterback. And here's the Falcons. Defense stacks up. It's a group that's third in the league right now in turnover differential. Third down coming up. They're hoping to do a better job converting today than they did last week. Trying to work that left side. Breeze hits Lance Moore with that pass. That's a terrible job by the defense in the gym. I mean, you, you got third and over 10 yards. You don't get a pass rush. You don't cover them down the field, and you give up the first down. First and 10, and Sproles gets the football. He's brought down. The Saints come to the line with five wideouts and no one in the backfield. Second and 10. Stands in the pocket, and he's going to be brought down. Well, you see it all the time. When the offensive line can't stop the defensive pass rush, then you have your running backs hit a defensive lineman before they go out for the pass. The quarterback snap count got the defense there. Sproles is in the backfield. Third and ten. Challenging the defenders to the right side. And a gain of 29. You just can't sit back there and play conservative defense in the NFL. The quarterbacks and receivers are too good. Third and over 10 yards, you play safe and you give up the first down. Tight end in motion. First down and 10. Darren Sproles takes the football, and he's tackled at the 32-yard line. The quarterback is coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. Reaches out and snatches it. Nice catch by the receiver, but it still doesn't get a first down. This will be the eighth play of this drive. Third and three. And he's forced to the ground. This defense you're playing against, they're pretty good. So it's fourth down near midfield, punt the football. Going to be leading the offense once again today. He didn't have a big game last week, so we'll see if that changes here today. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. This will probably be the last play of the quarter. Steven Jackson gets it here. under center and the second quarter is underway with this snap third down on the way here's the handoff and they'll run it and the tackle is made at the 35 yard line nice job that time the run play gets the first down. You move those chains. Hey, it's kind of fun to watch a team tough enough and patient enough to run the football to get these first downs instead of throwing it all the time. Drew Brees, Matt Ryan, two quarterbacks who can really light up the scoreboard, battling twice a season down in the AFC South. Oh, my gosh. Think how many yards are put up when these two guys play against each other. Both teams love to throw the football. They have many design plays to pick up big yards so it's always fun and Matt Ryan came of age last year became the leader of the Atlanta Falcons and Drew Brees hey listen he's 
He's got great courage when it comes to making decisions and throwing the football. That's why that New Orleans offense is always so tough. Watch the blitz, watch the blitz. Matt Ryan under center. Two minute warning. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down as they go ground here. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Going across the middle. Game of six. Well, you get a couple first downs. It just gives you such great confidence. It makes everybody relax. And I always say this, when you're a relaxed athlete, that's when you play your best. First and 10, escaping the pressure. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Can't hold on. You got to find ways to avoid sacks in the NFL. Two ways to do it. Run away from them because you got speed or good footwork inside the pocket. Nice job that time by the quarterback. Avoiding the sack and getting rid of the football. Throws to the right. Oh, and almost picked off that time. That's a nice route that time by the wide receiver running the corner route, and the quarterback just throws it too far and misses it. This has been a long drive so far. Ryan's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Makes the grab. Tackled down at the 22. That was good timing by the quarterback. He got out of pocket just in time before he got sacked. And on that scramble, finds a guy down the field, makes a completed pass. First and 10, escaping the pressure. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. He steps out. Well, they complete the pass, Jim, but doesn't get the first down. Sooner or later, you got to throw one down the field. Now inside the red zone. They were very good at finishing off drives last week in this situation. In trouble now. Looking to the right side and throwing. And that's enough for a first down. Good job getting the first down by the offense. A look at the defensive players on the sideline cheering their teammates on. Keep us on the sideline a little longer. That's what they're hoping for. What a drive this has been. And now on first down, they'll go back to the air. He has the grab. The offense is so close right here. They just need to show a little power and punch this in the end zone and get that touchdown. Play after play after play here on this drive. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Touchdown, Falcons. Well, when your offense goes out there and scores a touchdown to put you ahead, it's got to give a big lift to the defense. They got to get excited and go out there and hold that lead. Falcons getting ready to kick it off. The returner opts for the touchback, and the offense will begin at the 20. Drew Brees has it under center. Out of the eye, the give to the tailback. Nice job that time by the defense. They were ready for the run, nowhere for the running back to go and they stop him for a short game. The Saints break huddle and show a jumbo look. Second and nine to the ground here. Going to lose yards here. So that's going to do it for the first half. Falcons are up in this one. Let's check in on the sidelines. Danielle Bellini is there. Guys, I got a chance to speak with Coach McDonald during halftime. He's been a bit frustrated up to this point with the rushing game, and for obvious reasons, they're not moving the ball well, guys. However, he did also say that at the very least, they're not giving up rushing yards, which is a big reason we've got a low-scoring game so far, guys. Danielle, thank you very much. Now we'll go to the field. The Falcons ready to return the kick. That's a touchback. First down all the way. The third quarter begins with this play. Well, the defense, they give up a first down there. They're behind, 
They just can't sit back there and keep bending. You got to take some chances, go on the offensive, on the defensive side, and just make things happen. Gain of seven. Boy, there's nothing like a draw play. It just catches the defense by surprise, and running backs, they love it because they know they have a chance to get some easy yards. Second down and two. Gets away from the pressure, looks to his left. Complete. He's going to be tackled right around the 49. That time he's under pressure. Uh, he can't stand in the pocket. He takes off. And as you look down the field, nobody is open. So the quarterback is forced to run, and he picks up some big yards. Now in rhythm, the quarterback drops back to throw once more. Incomplete and almost intercepted. Coach is going to have a hard time calling deep throws down the field, but the quarterback shows the he can't even get it out there. That time he underthrows the football badly. The defense comes out of the nickel. Matt Ryan from the shotgun on the run. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Pass is made, and it's incomplete. The hit jars the ball out. Failing to connect there, third down. Ryan from the gun, looking to scramble, drops the pass. Do one thing at a time. Catch the football, then do the next thing, run with it. He tried to run with it too quick. That's why he dropped it. Jackson's in the slot, not in the backfield for this play. Ryan's going to take it from the gun, getting away from the pressure. Matt Ryan with the long pass down the field. The Saints turn the ball over on down. Nice job by the quarter. that time got outside the pocket got away from the pressure uh gave himself time even though the pass is incomplete good job of avoiding the sack sproles is lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback first and ten he's looking to the right here on this throw swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage good job by the defense they stopped the offense that time on first down now the defense is in a good situation The defense comes out in the nickel. Second and 12, throws to the right. The Saints now move the chain. When you're behind in a football game, all you can do on the offensive side is just go out there and thinking about making plays and picking up first downs, good job by the offense. First and 10, the give, running right through the trenches. When you're an offensive lineman and you can line up and just run the football straight ahead and pick up those kind of yards, you are going to get into the head of the defense. You're basically saying we're tougher than you are and we're just going to... Asante Samuel has his hands on it. What a terrible job by the quarterback. But nobody's open, tries to force the pass, and look, what's it turn into an interception? Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. They go draw. Now slashing to the right side, looking for room. Play this defense. They are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front. And that time they stopped that run just for a short game. Jones, a receiver in the slot. Davis has got the football after the play fade. He'll be brought down, but not before picking up the first down. Quarterbacks love play action passes because the defense, sometimes they're expecting run. You fake it, easy completion down the field. First and 10 gives it to Steven Jackson. He's got a wide open alley. What a run by Jackson. When you see long runs like that by a running back, a lot of things have to happen. Of course, he has good vision and he has talent, but how about those blocks down the field, those 
blocks in the secondary. That's what creates Flip long round. runs. Flip round. After the long game, oh, let's see down. what they do here. Flip round. Flip round. Final quarter underway now with this snap. He'll fire it out to the left. Tony Gonzalez with the ball. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. Let's Come on, let's go. Let's round. Let's round. Let's round. Let's round. Let's round. First and goal, working that left side. What a catch. Touchdown. Well, it's first to go. I think a lot of defenses are thinking run here until the offense, they call a nice play, very deceptive. They throw the football and they get the easy touchdown pass. The Saints getting set to return the kickoff. This one's not leaving the end zone. Come to the line, and it's first down. And he's taken down. Every defense is looking for somebody to hit the quarterback, and the best person to do it is the defensive end. What a good job that time by him. Nickel formation for the defense here. There is a flag. He'll fire it out to the left. Great pass, great catch, great control. The defense will not Still decline. They will take the penalty. Split backfield here. Looking to the right side and throwing. The interception. The tackle was made. Jim, this defense is just attacking today. They got the offense backed up. They go at them. They're aggressive. And what does it do for them? It gets them an interception inside the opponent's 20-yard line. Gets past the first wave. The defense has got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. White in the slot. Two minutes to go before this one's in the books. And here we have second down. And Davis is still has it after some nifty play action. Touchdown! Good job by the quarterback that time. He used his ability to get out of the pocket, and he is deadly throwing the football on the run. Extra point is good. The Saints now have even more work to do to get back into this one. The scores 21 to 0. No return. The ball's coming out to the 20. Offense lines up here. First and ten. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Asante Samuel has his hands on it. He stacked up at that point. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled. Being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did. They got the interception. On first down. Jackson's handed the football, breaks away. White's going to get set in the slot for this snap. Second down, three to go. Jackson's going to take the handoff now. 
That's just not a good call on the offensive side. Yeah, you know, when it's second and short, they, they think, well, let's just pick up the first down. The defense was ready. You got to have better play calling than that. Trying to make something happen. Got a little crease. Offense lines up here. First and 10. Davis turning to look downfield now after selling the play fake. 21 yard pickup. When you play a cover three defense, you protect against the deep pass, but the problem is all the underneath stuff is wide open and the quarterback is taking advantage of that. Here's the first snap after the big play. Throws the pass. Atlanta in for the score. What a job by the offense. So little time left to drive down the field and score. That just ices the game. Nice job by the whole football team today, but especially on the offensive side. The Falcons have their defense to thank for those points. That interception setting up the score that the offense was able to finish off. He'll kneel here. No reason to try his luck on the return. So the offense off the touchback will begin at the 20. Offense lines up here. Now first and 10. Ball is out. What a play. Snickers is the proud sponsor of this satisfying defensive replay. When hunger hits, Snickers satisfies. Eyeing that left side. Breeze connects with Colston. And he's going to be tackled right around the 31-yard line. This play set up by the long gainer. Challenging the defenders to the right side, and he's brought to the ground. The Saints call a timeout and are left now with only one. Sproles is in the backfield. First and ten. And he's thrown to the ground. The Saints will take a second here to talk things over as they call a timeout on second down. The Falcons defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. Ball's on the ground. They've got him down there. Play number six coming up on this drive. That's going to do it. The clock hits zero, and this game has come to an end. You've often talked about prime time and how the players of today have this it's all about me kind of a mentality and for you in the booth you had to enjoy it being all about you having a chance to call this one today in prime time
we are at Ralph Wilson Stadium for this Week 13 matchup between the Falcons and the Bills.